David, why do you ask the questions, who do we want to be, and what do you believe? Well, are you are you saying why am I asking those questions? Correct. You basically, these are two important questions you yeah. ask in the book. Could you elaborate on it? You know, why my, do you ask these questions? They're very important questions. My wife, um, Beth, who is Christian, grew up in the Methodist Church, and and gave me an, a, a wonderful gift, which was to agree to become a Jewish family. And we have three children, and and um, we're raising them as Jews. Our oldest son Max will be bar mitzvah this fall. She challenged me as she was willing to be a Jewish family, but she said, if you're going to lead us in faith, you know, it's a question of not just who you are, but what do you believe? And that question for me as a Jew growing up in Los Angeles with cultural identity but without real belief was something that really um, invited me to dig deeper and to challenge myself. And I think, I think that's essential because I think for anyone of faith to really get a sense of what they believe gets us closer to a relationship with God, which I think is really important. Because I think this question of who we are and who we are becoming is one of the essential questions of life. You know, kind of, are, are, we, are we living um, in a way that we should live, that we, that we want to live, that God expects us to live? Are we realizing our full potential? Are we living with a sense of meaning and purpose? These are questions that I think animate all of us. At some level, however we um, think of God, but I think beyond uh, career, hobby, interest, the idea of finding a sense of what brings meaning to our lives is something that we're all after. Whatever vocabulary we use, I think that's a deeply set, a seated question that we that we grapple with. 